And to pay for college is now turning into a full fledged business. Atlanta News first reporter Sawyer Bussey shows us how his ambitious idea had a little help from the school. Books are expensive. Tuition is expensive. College is expensive. Detail Dogs is an automotive detailing business that I started at the beginning of my junior year of college. Jack Terhar wanted to find a way to become his own boss, make his own hours and still bring in some funds. I'd worked in restaurants downtown and worked super late hours and I felt like I could be doing more with my time. And I also didn't want to miss dogs football games on Saturdays. He started Detail Dogs. It's super low cost to get into. There hadn't really been that many players that I'd seen in Athens. Business was there, but it was slow. I was doing it for four or five months kind of as a side hustle. That is until Jack says the accelerator program at UGA changed the game. And really starting to consider that this is a business that I could maybe sustain after college. The accelerator program is part of UGA's entrepreneurship program. In the accelerator program, we uh, take in students that have an idea for a business or maybe they've already started a business and we help them figure out where their market is, what their market is. Uh, we focus a lot on customer discovery, which is actually reaching out and talking to people about your product or service and if they would buy it and how much they'd pay for it. And, you know, if it's, if it's something you've got that's an economically viable idea. Jack graduates in May. Hit my stride whenever I found this place. Like I found other kids who were starting businesses and were super interested in entrepreneurship. He says the UGA program has inspired him to keep building a business he loves. We're really going to push you to get out of your comfort zone and find a customer. It's like definitely developed me as a person significantly more than I would have ever thought it was going to do. In Athens, Sawyer Bussey, Atlanta News First. Certainly on the right track there. Oh, isn't yeah, it? yes. Yeah.